What's up everybody, it is Royal J and I am back again with another video and this time I am unboxing Perfect. My new vinyl controlled by scissors so let's go right ahead and get into this video I decided to call this whole thing album Friday so every Friday I will be premiering or just uploading a video of me unboxing new vinyl records so that should be fun um so far i have four vinyl um records and then i have a whole lot more coming i ordered like over 10, <laughs> 10 vinyl records listen you have to have control when you're doing this when you are becoming a collector because it's like when you're new you just see all of these classic and amazing albums and you're like i gotta get it i have to get it i gotta get it so you're gonna be doing a lot of videos of me unboxing everything never mind the shine don't worry about that <laughs> so this is scissor control album um it was a fye for your entertainment exclusive um fye.com i get my vinyl records from ones that i've ordered the places where i ordered them from were fye urban outfitters amazon um I know me please and discard so you can check all those websites out i will be putting them down below in the description box in these particular videos the album friday videos so that you, that way you guys if you want to get into it or if you are a vinyl collector and there's certain vinyls that you want to look for you can go on either one of those websites and you might find it you never know i always look them up when i'm at work when i'm home i'm looking at different vinyls so this one is an fye exclusive and um it's actually the clear coke bottle version so i haven't seen anybody with that one so i'm like okay let me just go ahead and get that so uh. all right so we about to do that Here we go. Oh, I'm so nervous. I know I'm stalling, but I don't care. I love this album so much and it resonates so deep. Like it truly resonates. So I really, really needed this album. This was the first vinyl that I actually brought, but this is not the first one that came. So I was a little bit sad about that, but you know, it was Destiny Child writing on the wall that came. So I wasn't too sad about it. You know? But yeah, this is it, y'all. I'm nervous. I love this album so much. It's like the soundtrack to my life, to a lot of our lives. Like, Scissor just was in her bag, period. Ooh. Oh my. Did I get anything in here? Oh, never mind. It's like a receipt that came. But this is it. I gotta keep the sticker. Should I keep this? Should I keep this sticker, y'all? I might put it, cause I'm getting some other plastics that's gonna come that I'm gonna cover the vinyls with, and I'm gonna put all the stickers on them. So um, that came on it. But I love this album so much. Ah, look, the track listing, the ring light in the way, but it's the track listing. This is Scissor with her beautiful self. Um, yeah, I'm gonna put the sticker on that other plastic. Even though it's like, yeah, I'm going to keep it. But I got to take the plastic off because this actually opens. So, slide it off like that. Like that, like so. <laughs> and I'm about to open it. Ooh. Oh, look at that. Y'all, this is a masterpiece. Ooh, can y'all see that? Like, I'm ready for the new album. She's been playing with our emotions by not releasing anything. And I'm a little bit irritated. I know she did the song with Justin Timberlake, but that ain't enough for me. I just want her. Wow, it's clear, y'all. Look. So this is the Coke, the clear Coke bottle version of the album. And I haven't, I looked at unboxing videos and I haven't seen anyone with it. 
no shade, but I'm just saying. So it's pretty good. It just got a little, like it's a little bit of like a tear right there on the sticker, but that's fine. Look, as the record plays. I don't give a damn. <laughs> I don't care. So side one, it has Supermodel, Love Galore, Doves in the Wind, Drew Barrymore, and side two has Prom, The Weeknd, Gogina, and Garden. Garden is my favorite. Oh my God. So did another unboxing video on another album you guys go and check that out but i forgot to say what was my favorite so gotta re-record that and say what's my favorite so i'm gonna get into my favorites on this particular album but let's just look at the records for right now and just get into this greatness like my goodness because when i I was like, I have to get Sism Control vinyl, I just have to. And um, when I was looking it up, I saw that they had it on FYE and it was an exclusive. So I was like, okay, let me get that one. So, the exclusive. So it's clear. It kind of looks, it kind of looks green. Alexa trying to get my attention. But anyway, <laughs> it looks green, but it's not. It's like, it's clear. You know when you get like a Coca-Cola bottle um, and it's empty, it looks like that. Like that's how it looks. It kind of looks clear, then it looks green and it's crazy, but it's beautiful. So that's it. Side three and side four. So same stickers, same everything. Oh. I can't wait to spin it. So I'm about to put, um, let me see, which disc am I going to put in the turntable? Okay, I'm going to put this one because Broken Clocks is right here. So we're going to do Broken Clocks. And I'm not going to put like a long length of me playing the actual um, record, you guys. So if you want to see the longer version, just go to my Instagram. It's down below in the description box so you guys can check it out. I'm going to put like a probably like a three or four second the thing of me playing it and then because oh, we don't need be right strikes over here. We've gotten it before and we ain't getting them up. So there's a book in here um, that comes with it. Hold on. Oh. You're oh, download code. Y'all can't see that. Y'all can't see that. Okay. So, there's like these little drawings inside of it. Um, I never owned the physical copy. I just got like the digital. So, that's why it's so shocking to me to see this. But, whoa. This is so cute. I love when artists be creative with their work and not do anything lazy or just put anything out. I love when they do stuff like this. So this is that, and that is that. So I remember when I first heard this album, right? I was in college at the time. I was in culinary school, college, of course. During that time, we was just doing a lot of book work. Summer, you know, there wasn't really nothing for us to do. So we was doing a lot of book work and um, we was on a computer, we was in the library, just, that's it. I was like, I need to listen to music, like, you know, whatever. And then Scissor Head just came out and I was like, oh shoot, I gotta get it. I don't do that no more, you know, cause he got Apple Music, he got an iPhone now, whatever. But at the time, you know, I had, a, I think I had an Android, I believe. So I downloaded the album for free. I'm not even finna lie to y'all. I downloaded the album for free. I put it on my phone. I mean, I put it on my hard drive. And I went to school and I got my headphones and I put my headphones in the computer. I plugged my hard drive in the computer because it had my homework on it. And I was listening to the album while doing home, like computer work and doing uh, book work and stuff. And I was like, oh, I love this. And I just kept playing over and over and over. But eventually got an iPhone and then I brought the album, of course, you know, because it was one of my favorites. So let me tell you something. This album is me is so therapeutic and it's just so dope. And I remember when I first heard it, I was like, this is amazing. Listen to it every day and then around that time 
think Kendrick Lamar album came out. I think Damn had came out around that time, if I'm not mistaken. I was back and forth listening to their albums, like back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, the entire time. But you know, love it. So yeah, so my favorite song of this album would definitely have to be overall is Garden. I love Garden. I don't know. I just love the feel of it. Like I saw the video, I fell in love with the video because it just matched so perfectly. I felt like I'm on an island, just like vibing out to it. it just felt so good. Twenty something, because I'm in my twenties and I'm I, I've dealt with and dealing with half of the stuff that she said in that song. We all can relate. Everybody in their twenty somethings can relate to that particular song. So I just fell in love with that one because I'm like it's so relatable and I just resonated with it so deep. Um, Broken Clocks, another one of my favorites because it just talks about growing up too fast. We do grow up too fast and we gotta pay bills and deal with a lot of stuff, it's a lot, but I love being an adult and I love being able to provide in some type of way, so uh, I mean, it's okay. <laughs> it's fine. Supermodel, of course, the Weekend, you know, Love Galore, all of that stuff. But also, what's the name of, name of it? Where is it? Drew Barrymore. Okay, that's it. That's what I was thinking about. Drew Barrymore. I like the whole album, actually. It's a it's a vibe and it's iconic and it's something that it's an album that I feel like we can always go back to and vibe out to. It kind of it's like you know how everybody speak on Lauryn Hill's Miseducational album, iconic album, legendary album. This is something that I feel like I can go back to and feel a way about. You know what I mean? I love this album so much and I love how creative Lizza is with. Her artwork and her artistry is just so perfect and i love her so much so yeah i will see you guys in the next one i hope i can get her to sign it like that would be dope if i could get her to sign this vinyl it would be amazing in this video to scissor and let her know i want this signed okay when this quarantine is over sis and you go on tour hopefully there's a tour we'll be there i'm bringing it <laughs> so i will see you guys in the next video make sure that you like comment and subscribe and follow my social media down below in the description box click the bell to be notified when i upload and yeah um if there's some vinyls vinyls there's some vinyl records <laughs> that you guys want me to get and review and unbox so let me know down in the comment section most likely i'm already getting it but you know anyway just let me know in the comment section and i will do that for you guys because you guys in the next video peace